And Justin's calling in from Huntsville, Alabama, on our support Vice President Biden line. Justin, how'd your candidate do tonight? Well, um, I'm not necessarily a Biden supporter. I started out in the primaries very much behind Bernie. I'm a millennial, so that uh, that sways me a little bit. Uh, I feel that the baby boomer generation has really let my generation down. So I'm voting for Biden this time, but it's only because I have more sway in the Democratic Party, and I'm going to try to organize leftists to really make a run for 2022 and 2024. Like January 21st, we need to get right on it. Because if there's any way that you're going to move Biden to the left, that's how you do it. What did you think when he talked about being a supporter or not ending fracking? Oh, I'm absolutely against that. But hey, he's got to say what he's got to say at this time. I understand. His strategy has been to try to appeal to moderates and peel off some Republican votes. So hey, I'm okay with that. I don't really care too much when he kind of attacks socialism and such, talking about uh, expanding the public option or expanding Obamacare. We need to just scrap it, especially here with the pandemic. Single payer is the way to go. It's the cheapest way to provide health care to everybody, especially where Thank people you, in Seth, my we're age... leave it there. That's Vice President Biden. Now, come on. I was... I was... God damn. You can't tell me that I, I wasn't more substantive than anybody else that called in before me, right? He asked follow-up questions of other people. Now, I was go- I was going to try to get Troll Patrol in there. I didn't think he would cut me off that fast. Was that Steve Scully? That wasn't, was it? Wow. There wasn't even any follow-up. Also, I wanted to get in that I was going to make a donation to Harrison's campaign because I couldn't remember the dude's name. Right before I went on, was I was like, was it Troy? Was it Trey? South Carolina, the first guy. I kept trying to remember because I was going to say I was going to make a donation in his name to the Harrison campaign because, you know, fuck Lindsey Graham. All right, that's going to do it for me for tonight. I finally got through to C-SPAN. Wow, it is a conspiracy because they're not going to allow leftist voices that actually know what they're talking about. You heard him. You heard the way he paused. When I, when he realized I was a leftist, a millennial, and I could I could actually speak intelligently, like he was dumbfounded. And then like he goes to fracking. I didn't want to talk about fracking. I wanted to talk about healthcare. Fracking does I'm against fracking, but that doesn't fucking matter to me. What matters to me is my friends are dying because they can't afford fucking insulin. I have friends that have pulled their own teeth out of their fucking heads. I don't give a shit about fracking. But that's the way leftists get get treated. You saw it. 